डिफेंस सेक्रेटरी डॉक्टर अजय कुमार जी कमांडेंट नेशनल डिफेंस कॉलेज वाइस एडमिरल श्रीकांत जी मेंबर्स ऑफ द फैकल्टी एंड स्टाफ पार्टिसिपेंट्स फ्रॉम इंडिया एंड अब्रॉड इन द फिफ्टी नाइन्थ कोर्स ऑफ द एन डी सी लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन इट गिव्स मी मीन्स प्लेजर टू वेलकम यू ऑल टू राष्ट्रपति भवन आई एम श्योर दैट द फिफ्टी नाइन्थ कोर्स ऑफ द एन डी सी हैज़ बीन बोथ फ्रूटफुल एंड इनरिचिंग फॉर ऑल ऑफ यू इट इज़ अ यूनिक कोर्स इन डीड एज इट ब्रिंग्स टूगेदर ऑफिसर्स फ्राम अवर आर्म फोर्सेज एंड सिविल सर्विसेस आई आल्सो वेलकम द स्पाउसेज ऑफ ऑल पार्टिसिपेंट्स फैकल्टी मेम्बर्स एंड स्टाफ ऑफिसर्स हु आर प्रजेंट हियर टूडे द ग्लोबल इन्वायरमेंट टूडे पोजेज न्यूमरस चैलेंजेस to the world due to its changing dynamics events in the recent past have unfolded at an astonishing pace which could not have been foreseen perhaps even a decade earlier in such an environment each nation is guided in its actions by its evolving national interests and objectives unless a nation understands and adjusts itself to the changes that are taking place around it its own security could be affected our security paradigm extends beyond mere preservation of territorial integrity it encompasses it encompasses the economic energy food health environmental cyber and personal security dimensions of national well being in addition it also extends to a nation's soft power which features elements of art culture heritage values as well as learning exchanges from as the one provided by the ndc course intensive research and quality analysis in all fields are essential to develop a holistic approach to study a vast spectrum of disciplines adopting such an integrated approach would deliver rich dividends and meet the emerging challenges while doing so one must see the larger picture and keep the primary national objectives always in focus ladies and gentlemen there must also be a conscious effort to strengthen the linkages between different state organs in a democratic systems like ours all the wings of executive that is political leadership civil services and defense services must understand the constitutional framework under which the country functions we have to be aware of the strength and challenges of each of the wings and together create the larger perspective of national achievements the success of any nation state depends on how effectively it harnesses all the available resources at its disposal the foremost among these is the human resource the development of human resource for national security is the task assigned to the national defense college it imparts knowledge to senior officers from not only the armed forces and civil services but also friendly foreign countries to help them make informed policy decisions related to national objectives and aims i am aware that the curriculum of the ndc is rich and diverse it is also unique as i am told that spouses stay with the participants throughout the course and also play a role in enriching the social and learning experience i am sure that this exposure at the ndc would have made you more aware and well informed individuals who can make well reasoned decisions taking the country's security perspectives into consideration knowledge is power and the knowledge the ndc course imparts will help you in protecting the national interest being senior officers in your ranks you all are role models for the next generation of officers 
in your respective organizations. Your professionalism, integrity and honesty will be a source of inspiration for these younger officers. The role of the armed forces has expanded far beyond traditional military matters with the developments in military affairs and globalization. It is clear that future conflicts in the complex defense and security environment will require a more integrated multi-state and multi-agency approach. This course, therefore, plays an important role in preparing the military and the civil service officers as strategic leaders to deal with the complex security environment in a comprehensive manner. Additionally, the close interactions among participants from different countries enrich your outlook on many international issues. It also paves the way for closer international relations at the highest level. India and its neighborhood and the broader Asian continent is faced with multiple security threats and risks that have assumed global significance. Terrorism and violent extremism are common challenges that are both state-based and asymmetrical. Also, as Asia emerges as the hot spot and the growth center of the global economic order, security concerns will increasingly focus on securing our economic interests and growth objectives. Threats will come in all domains from the maritime space to cyberspace. We have to be prepared. I am certain that the 59th NDC course will contribute substantially towards this end. I wish you all success in your future endeavors and hope that you all will bring greater laurels to National Defense College and your respective countries. Thank you. Jai Hind.